for the record, I'm not that obsessed with Hello Kitty. I just happen to have a lot of Hello Kitty stuff in different parts of my house, like my bedroom, my bookshelf. Okay, so maybe I was like a kid in a candy store when I went to Sanrio Pura Land in Japan for the first time. So maybe I buy a lot of useless Hello Kitty souvenirs whenever I travel. And maybe I purchased the Hello Kitty Converse sneakers in 2018. Anyway, Kate was here, at home, still stuck in quarantine. And what do people do when they're stuck in quarantine? They clean up their houses and find a treasure trove of stuff. In my case, I found a lot of Hello Kitties. <laughs> As for my Hello Kitty collection, they're all authentic. Not the Divisoria kind, not the knockoffs that are called Hello Kitten or Hello Cray Cray or her nose is a bit off center. No, nope, all original. Let's start with the best part 80s to 90s Sanrio. When I was a kid, I was always in stores like Sanrio Surprises in the US and Gift Gates in the Philippines. Check out my stuff from my childhood, they're still okay, they're still in good condition. You can't be a legit 80s to 90s kid if you don't know who Kiropi is, or better yet, Kero 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 P. Say that faster. Kero 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 P. Kero 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 P. There. <laughs> when I was a kid, I went through a short lived stage of Kiropi, after which I went back to Hello Kitty. So here are a few items that survived my collection. Okay, back to Hello Kitty school supplies from the 80s and 90s. This is super vintage. It's Little Twin Stars. It was a gift to me in the 80s, but the date says 1976. What? 1993, they made Hello Kitty stuff in purple. Of course, I had to get one or two items, including this one. Remember the Trapper Keeper? Everybody wanted a Lisa Frank Trapper Keeper. Well, I wanted a Hello Kitty one, and I got this. Let's talk about the Gift Gate Birthday Club. Of course, I was a member. So the birthday club is a gift registry. You list the top 10 things you'd like from the store, and then if your mom, your relatives, or your friends want to get you something from that list, they get a discount. Yay for them, yay for me. <laughs> so here are some of the stuff they bought me. Titas, I still have them, thank you. What is in this Hello Kitty box, you ask? I'll give you one guess. Yep, more Hello Kitty stuff. Aside from Hello Kitty, do you remember some of the classic Sanrio characters? There's Zashi Kibuta, My Melody, Little Twin Stars, uh, Bad Bad Smaru, Pochako, Keropi, Tuxedo Sam. Who else? Felix the Cat from the 80s, and Lisa Frank stickers from the 90s. Definitely not Sanrio, but I just had to show you anyway. My childhood sticker albums. For something more recent, here are my souvenirs from my travels in Japan and Taiwan. Oh, look what else I found. Hello Kitty Pasta. It's, oh, it expires on 7-10-2021. July 2021, so I will have to cook this now. 
more Hello Kitty gifts from friends. Yay, thank you! And if you're wondering what that thing on my wrist is, it's a Cruciani bracelet. Let's settle this issue once and for all. Between the red and pink Hello Kitty, I would always go for the red because honestly, I hate the color pink. I hate it! So most of my stuff are red. And also, Red Hello Kitty reminds me of the classic, vintage, 70s style merchandise. Yay, Red! I am trying my best not to give in to the capitalism of the Happy Meal. Sometimes I win, but sometimes I come home with fries and a Hello Kitty toy. I swear, my Hello Kitty obsession is on the healthy side. I'm not a hoarder. Yet. I spend my money on other non-Sanrio characters like Disney and Snoopy. Do you ever find yourself in Daiso or Japan home and you tell yourself, Oh, I'm not gonna get anything. I'm not gonna buy anything. I'm just gonna look. I swear. And then you come home with these. Stuff you don't need, or stuff you told yourself you need, or may need, or will eventually need, in the future, or not. But it's Hello Kitty, so I need it. So, what do you think? My fondness for Hello Kitty is just right, right? Well balanced? Who am I kidding? I love Hello Kitty. I'll never outgrow Hello Kitty. I'll probably buy more Hello Kitty tomorrow, next week, next month. If they come up with a Hello Kitty Happy Meal, I will get me some fries and Hello Kitty to go. <laughs> Thanks for joining Kate Was Here's Hello Kitty edition. And tell me, who's your favorite Sanrio character? Bye.